The Bayan satellites Russian, Bayan also named Biokosmos, is a series of Soviet later Russian biosatellites focused on space medicine. They are part of the Cosmos satellites. Bayan space program Bayan precursor flights and Bayan flights The Soviet biosatellite program began in 1966 with Cosmos 110, and resumed in 1973 with Cosmos 605. Cooperation in space ventures between the Soviet Union and the United States was initiated in 1971, with the signing of the United States and Soviet Union in Science and Applications Agreement which included an agreement on space research cooperation. The Soviet Union first offered to fly U.S. experiments on a Cosmos biosatellite in 1974, only a few years after the termination in 1969 of the U.S. biosatellite program. The offer was realized in 1975 when the first joint U.S.-Soviet research were carried out on the Cosmos 782 mission. The Bayan spacecraft were based on the Zenit satellite and launches began in 1973 with primary emphasis on the problems of radiation effects on human beings. Launches in the program included Cosmos 110, 605, 690, 782, plus Norca modules flown on Zenit 2M reconnaissance satellites. 90 kg of equipment could be contained in the external Norka module. The Soviet – Russian Bayan program provided U.S. investigators a platform for launching fundamental space biology and biomedical experiments into space. The Bayan program, which began in 1966, included a series of missions that flew biological experiments using primates, rodents, insects, cells, and plants on a biosatellite in near-Earth orbit. NASA became involved in the program in 1975 and participated in nine of the eleven Bayan missions. NASA ended its participation in the program with the Bayan 11 mission launched in December 1996. The collaboration resulted in the flight of more than 100 U.S. experiments, one half of all U.S. life sciences flight experiments accomplished with non-human subjects. The missions ranged from five days Bayan 6 to around 22 days Bayan 1 and Cosmos 110. Bayan M In 2005 the Bayan program was resumed with three new satellites of the modified Bayan M type, the first flight was launched April 19, 2013 from Baikonur Cosmodrome, Kazakhstan. The first satellite of the new series Bayan M1 featured an aquarium by the German Aerospace Center DLR and carried 45 mice, 18 Mongolian gerbils, 15 geckos, snails, fish and microorganisms into orbit for 30 days before re-entry and recovery. All the gerbils died due to a hardware failure, but condition of the rest of the experiments, including all geckos, was satisfactory. Half the mice died as was predicted. Bayan M2 is scheduled to launch in 2023 on a Soyuz 2.1 rocket to an altitude of 800 km. The orbiter will carry 75 mice and studies will focus on how they are affected at molecular level by space radiation. Topic: <laughs> Launch history. equals equals see also